Hello, welcome to uh, hello, welcome to another episode of Nostalgic Nerdery. Today we look at the GI Joe Persuader. We found ourselves in uh, oop, bump the camera in Ocala again, and decided to stop by the vintage Toy King, and we found Persuader with box. So we'll take a look at both. Uh, Persuader high speed tank, as I see it listed online, was released in 1987, sold throughout 1988, discontinued in 1999. Comes with G.I. Joe, if I can get him out. Backstop. Who has a helmet? I think the helmet comes off. Yeah. I'm just going to leave it on. It's on their type. Uh, Backstop and Persuader part of the 6th series. Came out in 1987. Uh, Backstop was sold exclusively with the Persuader. Tank and... Let's see. Look at my notes real quick. Uh, oh yeah, if the American file cards are considered canon, then Backstop is the only Canadian G.I. Joe. Also, Backstop's body mold was not reused, but an original uh, mold was a reuse, reuse of an old body, as some toys and figures did. So, Persuader, really good condition, rolls nicely, wheels all work, all the uh, missiles and guns are intact. I am missing the pistol for backstop though, I'll see if I can pick that up separately. Let's look at the box, shall we? Jojo, real American hero, Persuader, weapons do not shoot, colored really nicely. Includes backstop with swivel arm battle grip. Other figures sold separately. See you back. I always really like the uh, art and colorations on the old action figure boxes. Makes me wish I'd kept all the ones my toys came in. But very few people did that. Now let's look at the back. Laser rotating gun, elevating main gun, six removable missiles, sturdy construction for rugged play, etc. Let's look at the uh, file card, shall we? File name Levin Robert A. Backstop injured so many opposing players in junior league hockey that his family had to move to the United States to escape angry parents. During his adolescent years in Detroit, he boxed in the Golden Gloves until he was barred from competition. He spent two terms as the undefeated wrestling champion of his high school simply because no one would get on the mat with him. After a short career in the Demolition Derby, Backstop found his true calling in the Army and eventually on the Joe team. Well, he's uh, quite the fighter, it would seem, isn't he? Don't mess with Backstop. Even though he's had more broken bones, ripped tendons, and severed arteries than anyone else on the Joe team, He's still strong enough and strong-willed enough to break, rip, or sever something of yours. He is very violent, isn't he? Enclose our top secret blueprints of actual Persuader. Add them to your G.I. Joe command files. I do not have those, unfortunately, either. I'll have to see if I can find uh, the papers, you know, that came with toys. So rare to keep a hold of. But we got the box in good, fairly good condition. You know, a little damage here and there, but the art is all there. Persuader itself is in really good condition. The stickers are still on. Uh, so, yeah. One note, this thing does say it uh, fits eight models. Uh, on the side here, there are three, and on the other side, three more. Uh pegs for you to actually 
replace Joe's. And you can have them in different positions. I think the uh, box, oh no it wasn't the box, it was the uh, online thing I saw uh, shows them uh, like kneeling and all on the side. So you, you can position eight Joes on it. So two inside and then six on either side. So pretty nice pickup. It's going to look great on my shelf. I have to see if I can find the pistol, maybe the uh, papers that come with them. Those are probably going to be hard to find because uh, you know you just no one kept up with those type of items. But I'm happy with this. So thank you. Please like, share, subscribe, comment down below. Let me know if you want to keep uh, seeing this type of content on the channel. You know, toy pickups, etc. Have a good day.